The present tense endings are o, s, t, bliss, tis, and nt. First conjugation verbs can be identified by the last letters of their infinitive. Infinitives that end in a long are, such as vocare, ambulare, and stare, are all first conjugation verbs. These verbs are conjugated in the following way. O, os, ot, amus, otis, ont. Note how the third singular and the third plural are both short a's. Second conjugation verbs have an infinitive that ends in a long ere, such as habere, tenere, and docere. These verbs are conjugated as follows. Eo, es, et, amus, etis, ent. Notice again the third singular and plural both have short e's. Also note that the first person singular is not simply an o, but an eo, habeo. Third conjugation verbs have an infinitive that ends in a short ere. Quarere, dicere, and trahere are all third conjugation verbs. These verbs are conjugated in the following way. O, is, it, imis, itis, unt. Note how the first person singular, o, is the only long vowel in this conjugation. Also note that the third person plural is unt. The last conjugation is identified by an infinitive that ends in a long ire. Aldire, punire, and munire are all fourth conjugation verbs. These verbs are conjugated in the following way. Eo, is, it, imis, itis, iont. Similarly to the third conjugation, you have I as your theme vowel, but here notice that the I's are long, except as expected in the third singular and third plural. Also note that in the first singular and third plural, the I creeps in before your expected ending. So instead of O, it's EO, and instead of UNT, it's EUNT.